Shifting focus to France now, where former French President Nicolas Sarkozy will find out today whether he faces a second jail term over massive overspending on his 2012 re-election campaign. The 66-year-old is still a popular and influential figure on the right, despite being embroiled in multiple investigations since being voted out of power after a single term in 2012. In March, he became France's first post-war president to be handed a custodial sentence when he was sentenced to a three-year jail term for corruption and attempts to secure favours from a judge. Two of those years were suspended. Sarkozy promptly appealed this verdict and under French sentencing guidelines, he has not yet been put behind bars. Judges say that he would wear an electronic ankle bracelet. Three months later, he was back in the dock over his lavish 2012 re-election campaign. Prosecutors in the case are seeking a six-month jail term for illegal campaign financing, an offence that carries a maximum sentence of a year in prison and a fine of $4,500. It is not clear whether Sarkozy, who claims that he is being hounded by the judiciary, will return to court for the verdict or not. He attended just one day of his five-week trial for questioning a snub that had infuriated prosecutors who accused him of acting as if he is not answerable to the law like everyone else. Despite his political setbacks and legal woes, Sarkozy still enjoys considerable sway in French politics, with conservative candidates in next year's presidential election vying for his endorsement. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.